unveiling the past, discoveries in the attic, fade into Alex, dust swirling in the attic's golden light. They find a box, blowing off years of neglect, revealing photographs beneath. Each photo is a portal to the past. The house, once brimming with life, stands majestic and proud. Alex's fingers trace the edges, feeling the contrast, cut to a close-up of a photograph showing a grand party. Laughter and music seem to echo from it, a stark contrast to the silence now. Alex finds a photo of a young couple at the garden, love and hope in their eyes. The garden now lies forgotten, overtaken by weeds. Moving on, a picture of children playing in the yard captures Alex's attention. The joy and freedom, a stark difference from the abandoned toys outside. Alex pauses at a photo of the house in winter, snow creating a serene blanket. It's hard to imagine such tranquility in the current desolation. They uncover a photo that seems out of place, a secret corner of the house, untouched by time. Curiosity sparks within Alex to find it. As the sun sets, the attic grows dim. Alex, surrounded by memories of a time long gone, feels a connection to the house deeper than ever before. Fade out with Alex holding a photo, determined to restore the house to its former glory. The journey to unveil the past has just begun. Unveiling shadows, Elizabeth's diary and the secrets of the house. Fade in, a dusty attic, sunbeams cutting through the air, revealing a diary amidst forgotten treasures. Its pages whisper tales of the past. Zoom in on the diary as it opens to reveal Elizabeth's elegant handwriting. A voice, perhaps Elizabeth's, begins to narrate her entries. The house, once a beacon of joy and laughter, holds secrets between its walls. Elizabeth's words paint a vivid picture of life's ebb and flow. As the seasons change, so does the tone of her entrance. A shadow creeps into her writings, hinting at an unseen sorrow that lingers. Amidst tales of garden parties and sunny afternoons, Elizabeth mentions a locked door in the basement, never opened, its purpose a mystery. The diary reveals Elizabeth's growing obsession with the door. Despite warnings, her curiosity becomes a compulsion, a quest for the truth. Her entries become erratic, filled with sleepless nights and eerie sounds. The house, once a sanctuary, now a prison of unanswered questions. The I final love. entry is abrupt, leaving I a chilling love. silence. Elizabeth's fate is a puzzle, the key lost within the diary's pages. Fade out, the diary closes, leaving us with more questions than answers. What darkness did Elizabeth uncover? The house remains silent, guarding its secrets, unveiling shadows, Alex and the haunted house mystery. Alex steps into the sun-dappled town square, the warmth and chatter a stark contrast to the chilling tales about to unfold from the lips of the locals. In the cozy town cafe, over cups of steaming coffee, a weathered farmer shares whispers of the house that casts a long shadow over their lives. Eyes dart around as if the very walls have ears. A shopkeeper leans in, recounting stories of vanished souls, their last steps trace to the ominous threshold. The air grows heavy, the light dims. An elderly woman, her voice barely a whisper, speaks of nights filled with unexplained cries that pierce the silence. Children, oblivious, play in the distance. Yet even they, in their innocence, steer clear of the path that winds towards the house, as if warned by an unseen force. Alex listens, a growing sense of unease not in the stomach. The tales, though varied, weave a tapestry of dread and caution around the forsaken abode. A historian, among the gathered, offers a glimmer of reason. Speaks of old feuds and tragedies that have seeped into the walls, birthing legends of hauntings. The day wanes. Shadows stretch, becoming more pronounced, more sinister. Alex feels the weight of the town's gaze, a mix of sympathy and warning. Departing the town, the house looms in Alex's mind, no longer just an edifice but a beacon of mysteries untold, urging, almost daring, to be unraveled. Unraveling the secrets, Alex's journey through local library clippings to solve an age-old mystery. Fade in. A dimly lit local library. The camera pans across shelves before settling on Alex, whose eyes are wide with discovery. Alex flips through age newspaper clippings, each headline more mysterious than the last. The silence of the library amplifies the intensity. Close up on a headline, unsolved mystery, the house on Willow Street. Alex's eyes narrow, a spark of determination ignites within. Cut to a montage of clippings detailing eerie disappearances, whispers of hauntings, and tales of a curse. Decades of unresolved stories tied to one house. Alex makes notes, connecting the dots between dates, names, and events with a frenzied focus. The puzzle pieces begin to form a chilling picture. The camera zooms out to reveal the vastness of the library and the enormity of the task. Yet, Alex's resolve hardens. A clipping from the 70s catches Alex's eye. It mentions a hidden room in the house that was never found. A lead worth following. Determined, Alex packs the clippings and notes into a backpack. The quest for answers is about to leave the quiet of the library for the mystery of the house. Fade out. 
The library's silence is now a stark contrast to the storm of questions swirling around the house on Willow Street. Alex's adventure is just beginning. A dusty warning on the mirror, Alex's chilling discovery. Fade in on a dimly lit, dusty room. The camera pans across, showing signs of a long abandoned house. Suddenly, the door creaks open. Alex steps inside, a look of determination mixed with curiosity on their face. The air is thick with silence, punctuated only by their footsteps. They wander through the corridor, eyes scanning the surroundings, taking in the peeling wallpaper and the portraits with eyes that seem to follow. In the background, a soft sound begins, almost like a whisper, growing steadily in volume, adding to the eerie atmosphere of the house. Alex stops abruptly as they reach the living room. The camera focuses on their shocked expression, then slowly pans to reveal a large mirror. On the mirror, written in the dust with a finger, is the message, leave while you can. The handwriting appears frantic, desperate. The air seems to grow colder. A chilling breeze wafts through the broken windows, causing Alex to shiver and look around nervously. Despite the warning, a spark of defiance lights up Alex's eyes. They take a deep breath, stealing themselves for what lies ahead. Cut to black. A soft, ominous whisper plays, will you leave? Or stay? The question hangs in the air, leaving viewers on the edge of their seats.